ha hmm it's not easy i just pray that may god never use our child's death to serve as a punishment or as a test for us i just got on social media and i'm seeing charles over every pages anything that i opened i'm just seeing um rip rip i said what is going on a child that just got drawn and then the child is dead and what actually annoyed me and i came to the conclusion that i have to make a video about it is about those who were who were happy i mean those comments i was reading people were literally happy for what happened to davido's family they are happy because they think davido is not taking care of other child that he gave birth to he's only looking after this kind this particular child so they are happy that finally the child is gone you people you need to know that this life eh, is give and take this life eh, is go and come back what you need to know is that this life is a give and take i mean this life you don't know what is going to happen next. You might think that this thing is not never and never going to happen to you. You are happy today that this thing actually got to them, but you don't know what is going to happen tomorrow to you. Don't be too happy, okay? Don't be too happy. So there was this pastor that said that he saw a vision about what was going to happen and what just happened. So to me, my point is that he saw the vision and then he said it. Not everybody believed in this kind of things. Yes, fine. But we need to know that there are things that are called evil eyes outside there. So whatever thing people say that is bad, I think we should just pray over it. Whether true or false, just pray over it because you don't know when and where this thing is going to happen. You don't know what type of angel is passing by then that just said amen to it that is my problem with african because they will tell you that these people they are just here for fame yes i'm i'm not trying to back anybody or just say that okay you defended the person the person what the person said is true no but let's know that there are evil eyes out there there are those who are wishing us bad in an each and every day there are those out there who doesn't want us to success i mean there are those out there who wish they were in our position and anytime we want to fulfill our aims, or anytime we want to do something good, they are going to, I mean, they are going to come our way. So we need to be prayer for one. And also, we should try to minimize the way we show our life out there. Because it's not everybody who is so happy about what is going on in our life. I would like to stop here today because I'm just literally going to cry. <laughs>